What's up guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie. If you've never seen my face before and today we are going to a new Barnes & Noble. I just recently moved to Columbus, Ohio. So if you happen to live here or know anyone who lives here, I need to make friends here. So let me know in the comments below. But with a new state comes a new Barnes & Noble. So I need to go check out, see what we're working with. So that's what today's plan is. But first and foremost, it is the end of August. So Starbucks just came out with their pumpkin drinks and the pumpkin drinks are just superior to all drinks so you know we have to go get one so I'm gonna go get a pumpkin cream cold brew and then we're gonna head over to Barnes & Noble and check out the store here see how it is but that's today's plan so let's go get our Starbucks and then we will head to Barnes & Noble can I just do a grande pumpkin cream cold brew please anything else for you that'll be it Right. Thank you. We secured the coffee and I'm about to head into Barnes & Noble. It's a two-story one, so we love that. It's the same as the one I used to go to in Iowa. I can't imagine just downgrading to a one-story Barnes & Noble now. So I'm glad it's a two-story. So let's go ahead in and see what they have.
at a Barnes and Noble. My B-reel went off literally right when I got in the car. So there's a little sneak peek of my books, but I'll go over them once I get home. But it was a good, quick little trip. I'm gonna run to Home Goods really quick and then go home and I'll show you what I ended up getting. Okay, I'm back from Barnes and Noble, so I wanted to just do a quick run through of the two books I ended up getting. So first and foremost, I'm sure you've seen this everywhere. It's called The Silent Patient. I have been eyeing this one for a long time because I love thrillers and I think it sounds super interesting, but I've never picked it up. So I decided I would pick it up. My dad also sent me a TikTok last night about a girl recommending this book. So I was like, I feel like that's a sign. So I went and picked up The Silent Patient. If you don't know what it's about, I'll just read the back. It says, Alicia Berenson's life is seemingly perfect until one night when her husband Gabriel returns home late from work and Alicia shoots him five times in the face and then never speaks another word. Alicia's refusal to talk or give any kind of explanation turns a domestic tragedy into a mystery that captures the public imagination. And she, the silent patient, is hidden away from the tabloids at the Grove, a secure psychiatric unit in North London. Criminal psychotherapist Theo Faber is captivated by Alicia's story and jumps at the opportunity to work with her. His determination to get her to talk and unravel the mystery of why she shot her husband will take him down a path more unexpected and more terrifying than he ever imagined. But I've heard incredible things about this book, so I'm very very excited going into fall time to start reading a bunch of thrillers. You'll see that's going to be the trend coming up because I love a good thriller and the fall time is the perfect time to read them. So that was the first one I ended up getting. The second book I have never seen before, but it is called The Sanatorium. It was on Reese Witherspoon's book club table. So I feel like it's gotta be somewhat good, somewhat good. It also says New York Times bestseller. So this is by Sarah Pierce. Here's the cover. It looks super creepy and cool. This one says, the newly renovated hotel Les Sommets, Les Sommets, I'm not sure. A former sanatorium high in the Swiss Alps has long been plagued by dark rumors. When detective Elin Warren's estranged brother Isaac and his fiance Lore, Lore, these are some strange names, I don't even know how to pronounce them. Or Lore, invite her to celebrate their engagement at the hotel, Elin reluctantly accepts. Arriving in the midst of a threatening storm, Elin immediately feels on edge, and when Lore suddenly vanishes, Elin must trust her instincts if they hope to find her. When the snow cuts off all access to Le Somme, remaining guests start to panic. Then another woman disappears, and she's the only person who could have warned them of just how much danger they are all in. So I thought this sounded super interesting. I'm also obsessed with the cover. I think it looks so intriguing so i thought i would pick this one up again for the fall time we love the thrillers but that was all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this little book shopping video i obviously didn't pick up like a ton of books but i have so many on my tbr so look forward to reading vlogs i want to do a few reading vlogs of books coming up and of course thrillers for the fall time maybe we'll do like a whole week of thrillers or something if that sounds interesting to you guys let me know in the comments but thank you again for watching i love you guys so so much and I'll see you all in my next video.